Hey guys, Hardy here from ecomhardy.com and in this video, I'm going to show you and explore some features of newly launched Shopify tool, which is called Sidekick. This is the Shopify AI tool, help you to optimize your Shopify store and boost the sales and revenue. So let's get started. So if you go to Shopify admin panel here, and if you go to right hand side, you will see this tool here. If you don't see it here, simply find this kind of symbol or option or thumbnail. This is the thumbnail. Simply click to that and it will open up the Sidekick. This tool is only available to selected Shopify stores. So in your case, it might not be available right now when you are watching this video. But in the future video, after 10 days or few days or few weeks, it might show up in your Shopify admin panel as well. So stay tuned. Now let's explore some options, features and benefits of this tool. Straight away out of the box, it gives you the nice prompts you can select any of these options to start with just imagine if i go with this prompt like which day of the week got the most visitors last week so if i select that it will start working on it and it will fetch the analytics and somehow because the store has not enough data it is showing day of the week and there was no data found for this date range so it is okay fair enough if you have the new store or if your store doesn't have many visitors but uh, let's go through this tool again like reset from here you can always click here to reset it if you want to create the test product quickly you can simply create by giving the prompt like this so in my case instead of giving this prompt create the test product stainless steel water bottle and it will start creating whole new test product here you can always preview the product. So if you select preview, you can see it has created stainless steel water bottle title. It has created the description. It has also provided the pricing and the status is active. By the way, this is just a test product. So I don't want to activate this product. I simply discard the changes. Now, if I reset again, and instead of giving the prompts, now go with the accent plan. So ask anything. So if I open, just imagine this product and this product is not selling properly. So what should I do? I need to change the title. I need to change the description. I need to change, scroll down and change the meta title and meta description as well. So I can be sure that it can increase the search engine visibility and traffic. Now, once the product is open here, what I do is I simply write it. Can you please optimize the product title for this product to increase the search engine visibility and traffic and sales for this product? When I key in the prompt like that, I enter and will start working on it and it will optimize the title for this particular product. You can see here it has optimized already. You can simply click to preview and it will change the title from here. So click preview and now you can see it has changed the title. Chroma key green screen backdrop 142 centimeter photography backdrop panel, which is okay. Another thing it has done is it has also changed the meta title, which is good. Now just to confirm the changes, what you can do is simply save. And once you save it, it will make the changes active. Now, not only just a title, I want to change the description as well. So can you make changes uh, description as well? So because the prompt was not enough, what I have to do is I just simply copy paste the previously given prompt. And instead of title, I would write product description for this product. Now enter. Now you can see it has made good changes to the description of this particular product. Now, if you don't feel like it has changed anything, don't worry. Before I click to preview, what I can do is I open the product. So it looks something like this one. The description is this one. And now let me click to preview button and it has changed to this one. If you're not happy with that, you can always revert back by just clicking to discard button. Okay, and it will come back to the original one. So what I can do is I can copy all the description here and I can say like can you please check the below description and optimize it to increase your traffic and sales and then i can paste it here and then enter and be mindful this is the early access so the tool may not work 100 percent each time so you just trial and error now you can see here the description has provided here is better compared to before and um, 
it gives the benefit, key features, and note, which is good. So what you can do is simply copy paste, manually copy this description and control A and paste it. Now, if I simply open the preview and compare the preview side by side before description and after description. So all the information is provided correctly and looks good enough. It looks more, more better than before. It's constructive yet providing all the features, benefits and details. Compared to before, it was looking more longer yet providing the same information. So I'm happy with that changes. I will make simply save the changes and it will save the changes here now you can also write like can you add relevant tags to this product and see whether it can add the tags or not now if i click to preview it will add the tags here you can see here i can save changes voila can you do product optimization by filling in relevant information like product type type color material features etc and enter and you see here it started making some changes now it has provided the product type description has changed the seo description seo title so rather than clicking preview so if i click preview the problem is because we give the new description here it will change the description as well but it will fill out the product type here which is good and it will also change the meta title which is amazing i simply have to revert back to original for this description and save changes good you can also write like fill out relevant meta fields sometimes it may not work it is not to the point like these meta fields are not working through the ai which is fair enough but apart from that it is helping me to optimize the product title description meta title meta description product type etc which is good enough now what else you can do now this was just optimizing the product now let's see what you can do with the collection as well so if i go to collection here maybe maybe this one and the description is missing so can you help me optimize this collection and see whether this short prompt can help or not now yes it is helping to optimize it has changed the title and description so just simply click preview and it will make changes here which is good simply save changes and now you can also write can you rewrite the description and this is the description it has provided if i click preview it will add the description here which is good save changes now apart from that what else you can do simply reset and i want to increase the sales i don't have much traffic and sales on this website so what i can do is i can ask maybe ask with what changes should i make to this store to increase sales okay and it will start giving me good information so it says optimize seo so improve your store visibility by using the relevant keywords you can click to seo overview and it will open up the more information page here close it it says leverage the marketing tools so marketing and promotions you can always use that tool as well there is a specific page on this topic here on the show files center you can always read that enhance the customer engagement run the promotions and discounts etc let's do something so help me create a promotion and if you click to create new promotion it will help you to open the discount page where you can add new discount you can also ask help me to create a marketing plan and it will guide you through how to create a marketing plan to boost the sales if you click to that and there would be more information so the possibilities are endless it's an amazing tool of course it is on the early access and you may not find full-on benefits and it may be possible that it would not work 100 percent each time but still it is helping you to save a lot of time energy resources and of course it will help you to increase the sales and traffic to your website so this was the overall review right now i can give this tool about 6 out of 10 rating 
because I found like there are some lack of features or some sort of issues with this tool but still I'm happy with this tool and I have started using this tool on everyday basis right now hope this video has added some value to you if so subscribe to this channel and hit the bell icon also if you like this video hit the like button and share this video to your social media and friends it will encourage me to make more useful tutorial videos in the future thanks for watching guys see you next time take care bye bye